A game that appears highly likely to deliver in every way. Two very able teams ready for a top-class confrontation. And no one is taking anything for granted on this huge occasion. Stay with us for all the action coming up next on EA TV. Good evening. Tonight, the spotlight falls on North London. We find ourselves at the home of Arsenal. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it's the opening contest for the two teams in this Champions League season. It's Arsenal against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Gabriel plays alongside William Saliba in central defence. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Nuno Menge plays with Ashraf Hakimi in the fullback positions. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And now they get the ball rolling. Martinelli. Arsenal struggling to keep the ball. Vitor Ferreira. Marco Asensio. Able to skip past his man. And defending as a unit. Kai Havertz. Budakor. And goes for goal! Equal to the task. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. Marco Asensio. And they have possession again. Abukayo well, Saka is a player capable of taking any game by the scruff of the neck. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing from him? Well, when he's playing well, he can unlock any defence. He can manipulate the ball, see a pass and beat defenders. He'll be key today. No oh, good vision. Tempele. Hakimi. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back.
No nonsense clearance. Declan Rice. Martinelli. And space to cross it. Havertz! It's still alive. No threat about it. Donnarumma. And the keeper has it now. Ferreira. Marcinelli. And now Havertz. And flag raised offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. Marco Asensio, Minch, here is Marco Asensio, Dembele, and offside just as he was ready to pounce. Yuri and Timber. Martinelli. Well, after pressing like that, maybe the short route to goal. Martin Erdegaard. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Yuri and Timber. Havertz. And he read it well, intercepting it. Gabriel Martinelli. play and an Arsenal throw in forthcoming Gabriel Martinelli no possibilities in the centre Rice and here's Saka nicely blocked and a fine piece of ball winning and the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Asensio. And back to Asensio. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. And we will have just one additional minute. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. Well, assessing Bukayo Saka's first half contribution, how would you sum it up? It certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. Declan Rice. 
Marcinelli. Oh, fancy footwork. They were playing fluid football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. Well deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. players waiting at the back post well there is the opening goal the pressure finally telling and they get the due reward well they love him and Arteta loves them it's great scenes here again and the question is how will PSG reply to that setback running with the ball confidently in a dangerous position and it might be and did just enough defensively PSG have been readying two substitutes and now both will come on Still dangerous. Saka. Just the challenge that was required. Fabian. Ferreira. PSG looking dangerous. Showing fine vision. Looking for the angle. Sends it back. And couldn't quite square the game. Close. Well, it's certainly a decent effort, but not quite good enough. They still trail here. White and here's Saliba Declan Rice hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them good work from PSG to win it back Gabriel Martinelli Rice with it. Kai Havertz. Martinelli. Takes on the shot. Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Donnarumma. Minge. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Options in the centre. Well, no problems defensively. Gabriel Martinelli. Rice with it. Martinelli. Yes. 
Vitor Ferreira. Teammates available. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And by a wafer thin margin, offside. And time for the change now. Gabriel Jesus. Well, it's been a really tight battle out there, and the Arsenal fans are doing everything they can to drive their team over the line. What a finish we have here. The fans are shouting, shoot! Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Vitor Ferreira. Colo Muani. PSG chasing this game. They're not out of it. The delivery. What great excitement. And the match is level. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is just inviting someone to attack it and it's a comfortable finish in the end which is made to look so easy it's a lovely goal so back underway following the equaliser Timber Rice with it Jesus. Arsenal remain on the front foot. Can they find a winning goal? Ferreira. And Fabian. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. And threading it through. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Jesus well the referee blows the whistle nothing to divide them after 90 minutes